I, Kazan, Great Chamberlain of Prince Radu, with my loyal fellow prisoners, have created a system for finding my sovereign's tomb. You who have found me, release my master from this torture, and may the grace of God go with you.
My god, it's the missing piece of the dragon's ring. I've found Radu's stone. Whoever you are, leave here immediately. The cemetery is in a fragile state of balance. Only the icon of St. George can counter the evil beings who are in this place. If the icon should be damaged in any way, the world as we know it may cease to exist. So run. Run away and don't look back. I know why you're here. I've seen Mina. She's in the castle. Can love make you so stupid that you're willing to risk your life again? You should never have come back. The demons are everywhere and they're waiting for you. And you can see for yourself that I've lost everything. From now on, nothing can save you. You will die. Does the name Kazan mean anything to you? He was the Chamberlain of Lord Radu, Dracula's half-brother. God rest his soul. He disappeared on the same evening as his master and a handful of loyal retainers. We didn't always agree with each other, but he was loyal. Why do you mention Kazan? I found his body and this mysterious parchment was beside him. You see these pentagrams drawn on the edges of the parchment. They represent the evil forces which reign in the castle. As for the text, it is written with a magic alphabet. Translating it is child's play. It speaks of the Grand Knight of the Order of St. George, a great warrior in God's service whose body lies in the castle's cemetery. The text speaks of a golden cross which was cast to commemorate his feats. It's a great symbol of devotion to the divine forces which could wipe out the pentagrams I just told you about. It is written that Kazan and his men stole it to prevent Dracula from getting hold of it. <laughs> A very wise move. 